Welcome back in Jeff Davis Parish. Some honorable men and women have gone, have gone above and beyond when serving our country. News 10's Bailey Liebert features a town doing their best to say thank you. I'm in Jennings, Louisiana at the Knights of Columbus Hall, where a ceremony honoring eight veterans recently took place. Well, they've already shown their appreciation for the guys that served, all of us, all their service. And that's what it was about, was just recognizing the dual town of Jennings, 10,000 people, and had to honor some the folks that served in Vietnam. The ceremony opened with a presentation of the colors while aviation sounds played over speakers. Eyes were wet as 13-year-old Daxton Broussard opened by singing the national anthem. I'm very honored to be a part of because I think we take for granted the sacrifice of our veterans so tired and we really don't know what they went so it's proper to honor them because they were willing to give their lives for us. Eleven Jennings veterans were highlighted. Honored A of us, we added on the, the only female soldier that we had and then the two killed at Act Shootles. Displays of books written about these veterans were set up throughout the hall. One of the uh, honorees, uh, the most highly decorated uh, soldier, in fact, was my best friend in high school. And I got involved in writing uh, uh, some of that story and having some input in the book about him. And then from there on, I got recruited. I, I had a background in writing and editing, and so uh, uh, I was glad to join in. The goal of this event is to keep the memory of these veterans and their sacrifices alive, to never forget. In Jennings, Bailey Liebert, KLFY, News 10. You know that I love this land.